In this video, I'm just going to go through and give you a evaluation of this type, this particular concrete stairway. You might have a stairway similar to it, and you're asking yourself, do I need to replace it? Is it in bad shape? What is, um, what would I, what should I be looking for? Now, this particular stairway has a crack. Any cracks like these, and when they get larger, small cracks. So if you have a crack like this, something you can barely see, it's not going to be as big of a problem today. It could get larger. But if you have a large crack in a key part of the structural section of the stairway right here, if this thing was actually to get larger, the, this section of the stairway could fall down. The top section or this uh, balcony might not. But the a crack like here would definitely concern me. Next up on this, I see that some of the concrete is flaking off, and some of it has actually flaked off and exposed the rebar. Exposed rebar is no good. This, uh, you know, it'll rust and then weaken the structure, and then you have big problems. So if you could actually um, remove the weak concrete and somehow replace it with some type of a filler then that would be great. Don't add, don't ask me to recommend some type of a filler for something like this. Um, this type of stairway here looks like it would need to be replaced in my opinion. Um, and uh, again, this is just my opinion. This stairway honestly could last another 50 years. Hard to tell. So you're looking for structural cracks. I do not see any structural cracks here except for the flaking. Who knows how deep this is, like the one we just looked at where the rebar was exposed. If you were to take a hammer and just kind of lightly tap on this and a big section of this fell out, yes, then we have a big problem. And uh, you probably would have a, that would definitely fall into weakening the stairway. Now, another thing that concerns me about this particular stairway is it's not real thick, the distance from the back of the step to here looks like it's less than four inches uh, and if it is four inches I'd be shocked and that's not providing you a lot of room for the rebar to move you know you could be pouring the concrete and push the rebar all the way to the bottom if it wasn't tied off correctly uh, just not not I would like to see at least six inches there the um, Posts that are out of level, this could tell you that the stairway has shifted or moved. That is not a good thing. The crack in the post, that is not a good sign either. Um, this type of damage here on the side, I really don't know what that's from. That could actually be from water or moisture um, working its way through the concrete um, or coming off of the side of the concrete and then... Um, slowly removing some of the uh, concrete finish. And who knows, this could have been actually the original finish of the concrete. Who knows? Um, this right here where the post comes up, this just doesn't, this doesn't look good. Uh, the rebar, of course, I already mentioned that. This, we're looking at the same section we looked at. Yeah, I would imagine if you tapped on this, this whole section right here, is going to come down and that uh, this is a key point in the stairway this is a uh, this is what's holding up this section here so without this support um, I would imagine you could severely weaken the stairway so my evaluation of this particular stairway is you know if you're going to let it go you know maybe put a chain up here you know, something that uh, um, do not use so you can limit the use of it until it is replaced. Um, if you're going to, you know, if you feel if you walk up and down it and it feels uh, safe and secure, um, that might, uh, you know, you might have a few more years. You could maybe do some repairs to something like this. Fill in all of the cracks. Um and all of the concrete that has flaked off. But uh, again, if safety is your concern, and that's the main reasons why I make most of my videos, is uh, to just kind of throw stuff out there to people to think about or warn them. And uh, if safety is your primary concern, which it would be to me, something like this would need to be removed. Most definitely. Yeah.